In this video clip, we'll take a look at how to get just one specific record, even though we're pulling from a list of records. Typically, this would create and apply to each loop, but um, recently I found out a little trick that will help with this. So let's go ahead and take a look. Here in our flow, we I've already teed up just a manual trigger going into the find action of Business Central, and I'm just pulling from a list of customers here. Now, I am using the OData filters to just filter this down by display name because typically, I can even take this out, this would give me you know, a whole list of transactions. And I know that because if I hit here, and now when I go here, I will see here I've got this row ID for my list of customers. And as soon as I hit that, you see that it gives me an apply to each loop which just gets, makes things quite messy and then you have to work around getting outside of the apply to each loop. So what we're gonna do is we're actually going to um, manage that by taking this out. Then I'm going to move this into here and I'm gonna actually do an expression here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell it to give me the first output of the body and then I'm going to tell it the list customers, right? I'm going to put that in single quotes here. Um, it's just telling me, for, give me the first output um, from the body of the list of customers. Then we're going to just finish up with this here value. And then, because you're wanting it to give you the value of that. So let's see here, finish this up. I don't know this by heart. Okay, so this is important because this is going to be whatever the GUID is or whatever that specific value is that you're trying to get from here. In my case, it happens to be an ID. So go ahead and I'll hit clear. And you see, it did not give me that. And if I save this, What we will get here is a flow that runs, but only gets us the first record from our customer list. It only gets us one record, which is exactly what we told us we told it to do. And as we can see here, we have a nice customer called Relicloud. So that's how you're able to get just one clip or uh, one row from this list and put it down into a record. For more great tips and tricks, make sure that you follow us here on TikTok and on YouTube.